How's it going, people? Doing all right? It's Christmas, and um, I'm in the spirit of things. So, thought I would talk about the spooky natural. Um, and I've been going through some of my stuff here. Mm. Good spirits. And I found a bunch of stuff I've been hanging on to. Found these a while ago. <clears throat> they amused me. I'm not going to read them all now, but I thought I'd show them to you. It's all about this Nancy Bradley celebrity psychic. Now you can enjoy readings in your home, all-day seminars, or a psychic home party <laughs> with the celebrity psychic, Nancy Bradley, one of the top ten psychics in the world. <laughs> and, you know, you could reach your uh, www.nancybradley.org. Um, there she is again, all over the place. Um, we legitimize psychic work. We, with you and Miss Cleo, <laughs> um, you have seen her on TV. Miss, must have missed that. Um, now read about the world-renowned television personality, Psychic to the Stars. The celebrity's psychic, Nancy Bradley, life readings, past life regression, in case you had a past life. Um, uh, classes, seminars, uh, spiritual channeling, um, personal empowerment, life coaching, animal intuitive, she can talk to your dog or something, I don't know. Uh, healer, connecting with past loved ones. And she takes MasterCard or Visa. That's how good she is. She's a few years old. She probably takes PayPal by now. And mm, now you have the opportunity to learn from the best. Come join us for psychic and spiritual development classes. You know, that or Scientology, you know, or the Self-Realization Foundation. But anyway, that's not what this is about. I just pulled those out of my file and it's like, oh, I've had these a few years. No, I'm here for another reason, but it's spiritual. I promise to show this off. I forgot who to. I don't have the internet right now, so I can't check. I'm up in the boonies. But, this is my Ouija board, which cost me a whopping $1.60 at the Salvation Army or somewhere. Um, more than a decade ago. <clears throat> Never played it. Um, but, anyway, this is the board. I used to hang, have it hanging up in my, on my wall of my apartment because I thought it looked kind of cool. I actually had people react negatively to this. They're going, I wouldn't have that within a million miles of me. And I'm like, Parker Brothers. Anyway, this is a yes, yes board. Uh, you know, we, jaw. That's yes in French and German. And it says yes three times. There's the yes over there. And it says no twice. Once on accident uh, right there. Just because the alphabet's formed that way. But we're looking for, you know, coincidences. Anyway, it's made out of uh, fiber wood. It's, it's a William Flood talking board set. And it's mostly complete. It's got this dealy bob. There's supposed to be a glass visor. You know, a little glass viewing thingy. 
That's not there, but otherwise it's all there. Just had dinner. All right, let's read the instructions. That's what they look like. All right, because you know this is probably pretty technical here. William Flood, talking board set. Ouija, trademark registered U.S. Patent Office, pronounced, and they give you two different choices, both trademarked. Uh, Ouija, that's the way us Yankees pronounce it, and Ouija. It's a mystifying oracle, trademark, pat, uh, registered U.S. Patent Office. So even mystifying oracle belongs to somebody. Uh, Ouija, uh, registered. Uh, talking board set gives you entertainment you have never experienced. It draws two people using it into close companionship. So does fucking prefer that. Uh, but anyway, um, and a lot of other things, by the way. Um, and weaves about them a feeling of mysterious isolation. Unquestionably, the most fascinating entertainment for modern people and modern life. Okay, uh, weird and mysterious. Surpasses in its unique results mind reading, clairvoyance, and second sight. It furnishes never failing amusement and recreation for the entire family. Loaded with fun, excitement, and thrills more intense and absorbingly interesting than a mystery story. <laughs> Directions. Place. Wait, I better get ready for this. This sounds heavy. <sighs> Brace yourself, people. It's about to get intense. I'm going to read the instructions. Then we'll all know how to have second sight. One for each eye. Ah. Place Ouija, registered. Talking board, registered. Upon the laps of two persons facing each other, Lady and gentleman preferred, if you're into that. Uh, all right, place Ouija mis uh, registered. Uh, mysterious message indicator in the center of Ouija registered talking board, resting fingers with the least possible pressure upon the mysterious message indicator. Allowing it to move freely over Ouija registered talking board in all directions. Questions may be asked and in from one to five minutes a mysterious message indicator will commence to move. But only if you got your fingers on it. It's not like that 13 Ghosts you know, movie, the original one. Um, the good one. Um, At first slowly, then faster. As it passes over Ouija registered talking board, each letter of a message is received as it appears through the transparent window covered by the message indicator, unless the spirits don't know how to write or don't speak English. I mean, I might be on an Indian burial ground right now and I mean, how are they going to spell out a message to me? They just have to, I don't know, throw me a smoke signal or something. I don't know. All right. <clears throat> Second, care should be taken that one person only asks questions at a time as to avoid confusion. Third, to obtain the best results, it is important that the person present should concentrate on the matter in question to avoid 
other topics. Uh, if you use it in a frivolous spirit, I would never do that, uh, asking ridiculous questions, laughing over it, you naturally get undeveloped influences around you. It'd probably piss off the spirits, too. You know, Captain Howdy might show up. <clears throat> okay. Fourth. Ouija, registered talking board, is a great mystery, and we do not claim that at all times and under all circumstances it will work equally well. Like if you're blindfolded, uh, Penn and Teller did that one, and yeah, it was moving, but it didn't spell anything. It made sense, because they were blindfolded and couldn't see. Yeah, so don't do it blindfolded, even if you're, you know, videoing the results or having somebody watch it, because, you know, it's going to be gibberish. you got to be able to see what the message is that it's spelling it out. Not that you're making it happen. <clears throat> Uh, but we do claim that with reasonable patience and judgment, it will satisfy your greatest expectations. I am hoping for the lottery numbers. Five, explore the mysteries of mental telepathy and the subconscious with this time-tested favorite. Six, Ouija, registered talking board set, should be kept smooth and free from dust and moisture, as all depends upon the ease with which the feet glide over the surface. Rubbing with a soft dry cloth just before using is advised. Make a little turtle wax, huh? Do not store in damp place. See that the registered trademark Ouija and the name William Flood appear on all parts of set of set and package. Otherwise, it ain't legitimate. Anyway, that's um, Ouija registered, William Flood mysterious oracle registered, and the distinctive design of this of the package and trade are trademarks. For the talking board sets of Parker Brothers, Inc. Salem, Mass. That's witchy. Uh, USA. Anyway, so maybe sometime I'll get some friends together and we'll, you know, preferably a lady and a gentleman, uh, me being the gentleman, uh, and we'll um, and we'll do this. I don't know, but not in a frivolous manner. I promise. Anywho, that is about that. So, I hope I satisfied your curiosity. Uh, had this for some time, and it was just a curiosity, a decoration. But, you know, what the heck, I got my own place. I don't have neighbors on the other side of the wall uh, that are going to pound on it and then tell my landlady I'm a Satanist or some shit. Because I own my own fucking house. There is nobody on the other side of the wall. I'm up in the woods. Maybe Smokey the Bear is on the other side. I don't know. Anyway, let me know. Did this change your life? Did it, was it fascinating or spooky? Um, and, hey, give me suggestions for videos. Maybe I'll, you know, do something. I got, I'm got. i going to have company up eventually, and uh, I might do some videos with them. I, I don't know. We'll see. Most of my friends are religious, which is fine. Um, anyhow, stay tuned. Peace the fuck out. Have a wonderful, whatever the fuck it is you're having. And I hope one of those things was uh, a happy holiday. Bye.